Media attraction. Meg choked does Marcus reveal her stage hiking pics on Coronation Week. Sick of liar. Meghan Markle was spotted hiking in California over the weekend after skipping out on King Charles's coronation. The Duchess of Sussex stepped outside for a peaceful 40-minute hike from her and Prince Harry's $15 million home Sunday morning. Harry and their two kids did not join Markle for the outdoor adventure. However, the suits alone was in good company with longtime pals Marcus Anderson and Heather Dorak. Marco kept it casual for the outing in a navy blue loose fitted top, brown hiking shoes, and an act of wear bottoms with a forest green jacket tied around her waist. Seemingly trying to stay incognito, the former actress completed her look with large framed sunglasses, a scarf, and a Panama hat. The rare appearance comes after many people questioned Marco's intention to not attend the king's coronation amidst her and Harry's fractured relationship with the royal family. Meghan Kelly claims that Meghan Markle staged her hiking photos over the coronation weekend, taking aim at her athleisure wear. Quote, She actually had a little neck scarf with a tie. I'm sorry, ladies, but we've all walked our dogs. Literally, nobody does that, Kelly said on Wednesday. Nobody wears a little necktie with the scarf and the glasses and the hat and the perfectly wrapped little wrap for later just in case it gets chilly. Markle was photographed Sunday on a 40-minute hike near her home in Montecito, California, without her husband, Prince Harry, or their children, Prince Archie and Princess Lilibet. She was instead joined by friends Marcus Anderson and Heather Dorak as events continued in the UK for the coronation. They were also accompanied by Kim Kardashian's former bodyguard. Kelly claims Markle's million-dollar smile was a clear indication the photo was not candid. Quote, oh you, oh hello, where did you come from? How on earth did you know I'd be here? It was obvious, like everything with this woman, Kelly snarked. The Post says contacted reps for Markle for comment. For the outing, Markle donned Princess Diana's Cartier watch, along with the Bentley and Skinner diamond tennis bracelet, which King Charles is believed to have gifted his late ex-wife. The Duchess of Sussex did not attend Charles' coronation, reportedly to protect her own peace. The festivities also coincided with Archie's fourth birthday on Saturday, and as a source told Page Six, there was no way that Meghan was going to miss her son's birthday. Harry briefly traveled to London to witness his father's historic crowning. Although he did not publicly interact with his father or brother, a former royal staffer claims the red-headed royal personally regretted not showing up for his dad if that were to be the case. Meghan Markle was far from England during the King's coronation weekend, but what was more remarkable was that the paparazzi actually got a photo of the Duchess of Sussex out and about on a mountain no less. She was photographed hiking for 40 minutes on Sunday morning. The photo agency noted that Meghan was a short distance from her Montecito, California home, and Harry, who flew back to, the, to California immediately after Saturday's coronation ceremony, was not with her. Still, Meghan appeared to be in good spirits, outfitted in Victoria Beckham sunglasses, a J. Crew jacket, black leggings, a black tank top, a straw hat, a pink scarf, and blue socks with brown hiking boots. Meghan was last photographed out with Harry on April 24th at an NBA game, marking the couple's most public date in quite some time. The Duchess wore a pink two-piece set then. On the day of Charles' coronation itself, multiple outlets reported that Meghan threw her son Archie a small birthday party with family and friends. The coronation, of course, was on Archie's fourth birthday, part of the reason why Harry had to rush home. But Archie's birthday is not the only thing that kept Meghan from attending. Royal reporter Omid Scobie explained that she intended to not cause any drama during his appearance on ITV's This Morning on Wednesday.